let's talk about how to acquire multiple streams of income. We all look at it as, oh, well, my job pays so much. I'm good on my own. But when you get paid a certain amount, it takes years for raises. Sometimes you never receive a raise. So you're consistently getting that steady pay. So if you started off making $10 an hour, 10 times 8 hours is what? $80 a damn day. So if you're working even 12 to 14 hours, you're really tiring yourself out at the end of the day. Then some jobs pay you for overtime daily. Sometimes jobs pay you for over 40 hours a week. And then when you get close to that 40 hours, that 41 hours, they'll stop it. Like, you know, you leave. They'll send you home early to really try not to pay you overtime. So having multiple streams of income helps you out in the end. Multiple streams of income can be a side hustle. It can be um, taking surveys online. It can be working for an independent contractor. It can be doing sideline contract work for the government. So let's break it down. So if you have your regular nine to five, say for instance, example, you're making $10 an hour, you work in only eight hours a day, and you're pulling in $400 a week before taxes. That's not nothing. That's not even nothing to survive off of. Four times four is what? 16, you're making $1,600 a month, okay? Rent 1,200, you're really scratching the surface at the end of the day. So having multiple streams of income will turn at 400. Well, when taxes eat it up, we're looking at anywhere from 360, maybe 360. Say, for instance, it's 360. You're making that 360, right? So say, for instance, you pick up a survey job online. Some of these survey jobs are, are accurate. I have one that I will do a video for to show you. They're accurate, okay? So instead of you taking your money to pay for your lunch, you doing surveys online, you make that quick five to ten dollars, that's your lunch. You can make that every day and cash out every day. So that's what? Two streams of income now, right? Government contract work or just the side hustle of selling things, right? Get your sale game up. Start speaking to people. Get your communication skills up. We talk on here every day, but I bet a lot of y'all can't even do a sales speech to get somebody to buy your stuff. When you take up a sales job, it's daily sales every day. Keep your bank account in, out, in, out, in, out daily. 